I, I just want to say this, and, and I, I want people to listen very, very carefully here so this is not taken the wrong way. But we were in Cracker Barrel, and I, I, let me preface the story to this. My wife is Mexican, okay? Um, so she's got some fire in she's her. She's got some fire in fuego. her. Fuego. Right? She's a fuego. Muy fuego. Yeah. So uh, but my point is, and then my youngest daughter uh, is, is married, and she has um, her husband's half black. So my point is this, the people that are listening right now, uh, remember that story when I'm about what I'm about to say. So we're in Cracker Barrel and I see this family walk in and for the sake of description, I'll say black, African-American, whatever, as we'd say in the Marine Corps, dark green. OK, and then they all have masks on. This is just a couple of weeks ago. And then they sit down and they have masks on and they lift the mask off to eat and they put it back on. And when I saw this, I went over to them and I said, excuse me. I said, I want to tell you a story real quick. And I said, you see my family over there? I said, my wife's Mexican. My granddaughter's 25% black. I said, I just want you to know where I'm coming from when I say what I'm going to say. I said, I want to remind you that first, anybody at this table, you're not black and I'm not white. You're dark brown and I'm piggy pink. Okay? <laughs> so having fun. Because I don't like that narrative of the black and the white. It's very divisive and people have bought into it. And the Marine Corps were smart in that for dark green, uh, uh, light green, whatever. But my point is, I told them, I said, listen, do you find it ironic that the very people that are telling you to wear this mask are the same people who go into your inner cities and slaughter the babies of black and Hispanics. Those are the same people telling you they care about you and to wear that mask. And so I don't mean to be political, but at the same time, right is right and wrong is wrong. And you said earlier, uh, you know, you sniffed things out and uh, it looked like uh, this thing we were going through had more holes than Swiss cheese, right? And so I just want those that are listening um, you know, brown, uh, piggy pink, whatever they want to say color-wise, uh, across social um, uh, races, uh, financial, you know, means. Uh, we need to pay attention to our freedoms and what's being to uh, taken from us, uh, what we're allowing to be taken, and then also the agenda that's being pushed on us uh, because it's just so many times not the fact.